Good afternoon and welcome to the vlog. My name is Spencer and you are watching the Top Line Racer channel. Um, today, it is a beautiful day in, for February in Pennsylvania. Um, like 60 degrees and sunny, so that's nice. Um, right now, what we gotta do is a couple different things. One, we're going to uh, pull a couple parts off the G6 parts car that you saw in the vlog yesterday. Um, somebody's going to come pick up the uh, bumper and uh, front fender, so we're going to time lapse that. And then after that, hopefully, we're going to get a little bit of time to work on putting the steering column, the new steering column, in the S10 down there. Um, I'm not sure what all is involved with that. I've never done it before, but uh, we're going to try to switch that out and see if we can get that running. All right, let's get started. All right, so the good news is that all the parts on this I only put on loosely. Um, so it shouldn't take very long to pull off, but uh, we'll see here. Just gotta get some tools. time lapse but that was like maybe five minutes so uh there's you can see some of the damage here all right let's go work on the s10 all right so my thoughts right now after uh doing the video yesterday i'm thinking that if we can get this s10 running and uh the transmission and four-wheel drive and everything like that work that i don't have to dump a bunch of money into it we'll probably just turn it into an off-road uh vehicle for some uh for some fun content that way if it doesn't if there's other issues then we're just probably going to end up parting it out and going from there but right now let's see uh see what all tools i got to go back in the garage and grab to uh do the steering column install all right so upon investigating here it really looks like there's only uh really five bolts there's the two down here two up there and just one that mounts onto the actual shaft going to the uh, steering box down below so then some big wire connectors and everything obviously for your ignition and everything but otherwise it looks fairly simple it's just going to be if we can uh, actually get to everything or not i'm not sure so we'll have to find out Forgot one thing. We got to uh, jump start the Envoy. I know I had it running yesterday, but the battery in it's pretty weak. And I uh, got some folks coming to look at it tonight, hopefully to sell it. So uh, don't want to have to jump it when they get here. I'll let it run for a little bit and hopefully charge it up some. So that's what I got to do real quick. It really needs an exhaust manifold. It's cracked. It's loud, but it does actually run good. It's just, it's just loud. So, um, if you don't have one of those little jump packs, man, go get them. They're like fifty dollars. Just gotta be careful. Sometimes they explode, but uh, that's another story. So, all right, back to the S10. just take a little little break because we're gonna say hi to my puppy Brooks <laughs> hey what's going on man hmm where's your brother at hmm huh? is he up there yes he is oh man pretty exciting stuff and now I think it's time to go back in So 
I've not had good luck so far as far as trying to get it to start. I have my little jump pack, which is great, but uh, I'm not sure it's giving good enough juice because I've jumped a couple cars with it and haven't recharged it. So I'm gonna get the old rescue plow truck again and uh, hook up the jumper cables on it and see if we can uh, see if we can get any uh, I don't know troubleshoot a little bit. That security light flashing. I think that might be part of our problem. All right, guys, back in the garage here. We uh, completely ran out of daylight. As you can probably see by the window behind me, it's dark out. Um, did not get the truck to start for any longer than usual. It ran just a second and then shut off. Um, so I'm gonna try to do a full reset of the uh, uh, security system tomorrow. And uh, hopefully that'll work, but uh, I don't know. We'll have to see. It might need might need reprogram. I don't I don't even know. I know it's pass key, and that's a huge uh, hassle sometimes. So I don't know. We'll find out. But uh, as soon as we do, we'll do a part two of this video, and uh, we'll get that truck uh, out off roading and all that stuff. So hopefully hopefully we can figure that out soon here. All right, guys, have a good night. Please like and subscribe. See ya.